So you want to get the girl back to your apartment so you can start making all those sweet moves? Well, what better excuse is there than watching a DVD? Yeah, I've had that line used on me a couple times. We know your plan, I know your plan, and now we have your picks in DVD's day. Welcome back, Chris. I'm here. My favorite day of the week. Mine too. To see you. Mine too. I get to come to in and hang you. out. You're a nice Taylor Hicks hair. Oh, well, thanks. <laughs> really? Taylor Hicks. Uh, a little bit, a little bit. But I love it. You, Thank you. You had it first. Thank you. So we're getting into our first DVD, The Hills okay. Have Eyes. I didn't see that one. Hills Have Eyes is a remake of uh, the Wes Craven classic from 1977. Mm -hmm. um, if you're a big horror fan, everybody knows about this movie. The, the remake, though, I gotta tell you, um, they, they changed the plot somewhat. It's about uh, this family that gets lost in the hills, yeah. and these cannibals come out and attack them. Um, the original follows that at the beginning, but then you find out that they're basically mutants huh. um, that have been altered because this, they uh, settled in an area that was an atomic test site. and. Uh, it just it just falls apart from there mainly because you don't care so much about the main characters. Although there's that hot chick from Lost is in it, the blonde one who had oh, the baby. The, um, the, Her uh, name escapes me. Yeah, um, yeah, I'll have to check that on IMDb. But anyways, em so, Emil Emil Deravel. Exactly. Yeah. I, we have to say I, commercial agent. That's why. Oh ah, well, there you go. There you there go. You go. You're, nice you're in the know on that. Nice um, girl. The special features on the disc: um, commentary uh, by the filmmaker Alexander Aja, uh, who did High Tension. Um, Wes Craven does a commentary with one of the producers that unfortunately is one of the most boring commentaries I've ever heard because all they talk about is producing um, and they talk about the boring parts of producing which is basically time management. You're falling asleep as I'm telling you this. I know, I've tuned you out. A few behind the scenes. There's one thing that I thought was cool in this movie. This film probably has one thing. Probably the best makeup effects in a horror film of the last 10 years. I mean, unbelievable makeup effects with these mutants. We're seeing some of it now. So that's the saving grace for but that's, this. But that's the problem is that you can't have one without the other. You've got to have two great things. Well, you yeah, have I a mean, storyline. And if you're going to re, they yeah. more of like did a reinvention, not a remake. So exactly. So what do you do? What's your recommendation? Recommendation is uh, you got to pass on this. Pass it. Pass, pass. and get the original. The original Hills Have Eyes is amazing. So we're going to pass right on to Siriana. It's a great movie. You have to watch it a couple of times we were just talking about. Exactly. Syriana is one of those films that's very complex about mm -hmm. the oil business, uh, starring George Clooney as a CIA agent and uh, Matt Damon. Uh, very complex plot about all of these people that really have, are separately, um, they're connected, but don't even know each other. Yeah. Um, uh, heads of state, people in the oil business, people Basically, in politics. It's, it's very hard it, to explain. Yeah, it's, very, it's, it's like hard to explain yeah, the story. Even but, you, Chris Gore, the, the magic right movie man. Well, I'm somewhat hard. incoherent. Mm -hmm. I, 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 but, it is, but basically, um, you watch it, I watch it. I de a definitely a recommendation. A it's, it's, it's one of those things, um, there's no commentary on it. There's some good, good behind the scenes with George Clooney. It's a must-see. It's a, a high recommendation as a rent because it was one of the best films of last year. You absolutely need to see it. So it has great Surround. special features, it's a great movie. It's all yeah, good. No commentary, but worth renting. Solid rent. Now, Kiss Kiss Bang Bang, that was a really popular movie. It's uh, like kind of underground at first, and everyone started talking about it. Exactly. Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Bang Bang, uh, written directed by Shane Black, yeah, starring Robert Downey Jr. as this sort of loser yeah. thief, and uh, uh, he becomes friends with this guy, uh, played by Val Kilmer, um, named Gay Perry, and it's absolutely hysterical film, as this convoluted noir plot, but you don't really care because everything about it is so funny. It also has the woman who's now in the, who's playing Tom Cruise's love interest in Mission Impossible 3. But she, yeah. She's in it as well. It's it's just it, this convoluted plot that's hilarious. Special Robert features? Downey Jr. gets his finger chopped off. Yeah, special features are great. Um, there's a, a gag reel, and there's a behind the scenes, or, or there's a yeah. commentary on it that's fantastic so, with Val Kilmer. So you're saying? The cast. That is a buy. That is a buy. definite buy on now, Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Now, you always bring a little something special with you, so quick pick. I got a little something. Um, I don't know if it's special, but um, here you go. Might want to get a close-up on this. This is Hollow Man, Man 2, 2, starring Christian <laughs> Slater, no. and he's not on the cover. The good news is, Christian, Wait, you're, he's on the side. He's a, he's, this he's is the, the thing. Side. Christian Slater, you're starring in a movie. The bad news, you're invisible. <laughs> so there you go. That's my anti-quick pick. Anti-quick yeah. pick, so don't Avoid get it. Avoid Hollow Man 2. <laughs> Thank you so much, Chris. Thanks a lot. And I'll to uh, visit filmthreat.com or chrisgore.com for more movie info.